Got here a Delta 4 inch joiner model 37 290 that I have just recently acquired. As you can see here, there's quite a bit of surface rust, and this was actually, I couldn't resist cleaning up a little bit of it, so I cleaned up some of that to start as I was taking inventory of how we're looking here. But uh, just from serial number appears to be from the late 1980s and uh it's gonna it's gonna need quite a bit of work you can see under here we found a mud dauber nest and uh there was another one in the uh dust collection chute i've got a half horsepower motor here and uh we're gonna get this all cleaned up and running again
here's the little piece that holds those two together. And as you can see, there's a couple of washers in here as well. But one side of the screw is machined flat to be able to set that uh, set screw on. Taking apart the cutter head, pulled out the knives and found this, thought it was kind of interesting. There you go, made in West Germany. So I'm going to be repainting everything and uh, before we do that we're going to use this Loctite rust neutralizer. Uh, we're going to spray that on all the rusty areas and this will actually turn that rust black and uh, it'll turn it into a paintable surface for us. So we'll go ahead and, and spray all that on here and get everything ready for painting. Thank you.
I'm getting ready to put the tables back on. I've got here some white lithium grease. I'm gonna put here on the dovetail ways before we get those tables on. And here we are pretty much done from where we left off. All I had left to do was to put the motor back on here. It's hooked up to the, with the pulley on the back. And then uh, right here, I had to put the, the switch back on. The motor will work uh, when it is not attached to the pulley, but it will not run uh, when it is under load with the pulley attached on there. So I will probably just let it go as is because about two weeks after I got that four inch, I ended up with this six inch over here. So uh, it's always a lot of fun to bring these machines back to life. I really do enjoy it and I hope you all uh, enjoyed the video and, and got something out of it. Thanks for watching.